for you. Is this actually starting? <laughs> not yet. Do you have a notice with the non available? The what? Yeah. Yeah, Alex right here is Manhattan College. And Alex might be the person you were talking about. He's really good at Captain Falcon. He's really good at a lot of the characters. Oh, is this it? Yeah, I think I, I think this is yeah, this All is right, we're in. this is it. So Okay, so we have Caleb. SBU is port two with the Captain Falcon. And who's this Captain Falcon player? Oh, equal. This is equal. Okay, I heard he took out an entire team on his own. So, so, yeah, this is Stony Brook versus Manhattan College. Manhattan College going in with the Sheik, um, who I don't know his name. But uh, Manhattan College is port three. And Stony Brook University, SBU, is uh, port two. Uh, MC. MC. Yeah. Oh, wow. So Manhattan College takes an early lead. The equal coming back, trying to do a little bit of air wobbling. Should be a good edge guard. She doesn't have her jump. And we're down to equal stocks again. 19 apiece. You guys are each doing five people? Yeah. All right. So 19 stocks both. Oh, we got some t some interesting tech chase choices, which are working. One trick that a lot of Marths use when uh, when Falcon hits your shield and starts jabbing you, just hold down and ooh. Oh, that's, that's unfortunate. unfortunate. You just hold down and you mass shield grab. Eventually, they'll stop jabbing, or they'll go into the rapid jab, and you'll get the shield grab before it happens. Oh, okay. Oh, oh we get stumped though, and wow. All right. So the Sheik has to keep his composure. That's like when you when you SD basically SD twice like that. That's tough. But so this is this is going to be really important. If he can get this stock here. There it is. Now all he needs is the needles. Oh, so you can you can just stand on stage and throw three needles, and the needles prevent Falcon from grabbing the edge. Um, uh, yeah, he can't really decide how he wants to edge guard him. I think just perhaps a lack of practice in the matchup. But he gets that stock anyway, bringing it back. So now we're at 19 or 18 stocks to 17 stocks right now in Stony Brook's favor. Falcon going in with some Falcon stuff. We're looking for the air wobbles. Ooh. All right, good catch with the teleport. Oh, good try with the forward smash. Gets shield forward grab, Forward smash though. on shield, very unsafe. One very of the most it. unsafe options. Ooh, and all he needs to do is grab edge. And, and that's, that's it. it. All right, so Stony Brook takes the lead, takes the first match. Starting off pretty well. Got two stocks going into the next game. And Vortex is getting hype. Vortex is getting hype. You must have been, yeah. Thank you, I appreciate that. How many stocks each side? 20 stocks, it's now 16 to 18. 18 for Stony Brook, 16 for Manhattan College. Manhattan College. Stony Brook is 4 2 right now? Well, yeah, the left side left side is uh, Stony Brook, right side is Manhattan College. Because they're 4 2 and 3, I guess. Oh, yeah, I guess it depends on. Take. All right, so Manhattan College is discussing their counter pick. 18-16, yeah, for uh, Stony Brook. All right, so we have just Spring for Manhattan College. Spring, the Fox player, going in against equals two remaining stocks, trying to... We have Sp Spring is the Fox player. And then equal is the Captain Falcon. And and the, the Captain Falcon is for Stony Brook. Right, so so uh, with with the prep tag, the Fox player is Spring for Manhattan College. And then for SBU, we have equal. Alright, there we go. 
discussing his uh, counter pick. And it looks like they're just going to go back to Battlefield. But yeah, go. Go for it. You guys are good. All right, yeah, Battlefield again. Yo, get hyped for the Falcon Punch. Reminds me of uh, the crew battle between um, Michigan and Pittsburgh when uh, Nakamaru, as he took some of his own stocks to set up for the next match, he did a moonwalk, jump, Falcon Punch. It got everyone super hyped. That's pretty awesome. Even the way you kill yourself can get your crew motivated. So now we're going to see how Spring is going to deal with this ferocious Falcon of equal. All right, I'll just spacing, pull the wave dash back. Yeah. Oh, oh, very no good tech. knee. And that takes the stock. No, no tech, no DI, and that's what happens. You lose your stock. Oh, we great tech chase. Yeah, equal doing a lot of uh, just spacing out, uh, throwing out aerials in the neutral to just sort of uh, keep sp uh, spring at his distance. That's really smart in this matchup. Wow, great angle of the gods. Not a gentleman, no follow-up, oh, but he gets the knee. Oh, great wow. knee. He's so good. And just like that, equal makes this match way different. Yeah, Spring is just trying to figure out how to get in. A little nice running up smash, but all these hits aren't really leading to anything. Oh, he tries the edge guard, but he gets hugged. <laughs> And that, that'll be it. No. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh my goodness. He dragged that one out. He went, he went way out for that. Yeah, equals, equals feeling himself. Equals really feeling it. Okay, good nair from Spring. So you don't really have to uh, grab the edge when you're edge guarding Falcon, um, especially when he's close, because they're going to they're gonna recover high and try to sway back and forth to confuse you. So you just go up there and hit them before they have the chance to do that. Spring able to take the stock though is good. But he's getting comboed pretty hard right now and he and Spring is still having the hardest time of just getting in. Okay, no follow up from equal on that one. Yeah, anytime Spring's able to get himself out of trouble, he's just not really capitalizing. He's just sort of getting back into trouble. Yeah. Eagle's not making him easy for it, though. He's following up incredibly well. And that'll do it. And Eagle knocks out two members Eagle so far. Eagle has taken eight stocks, losing only three. Manhattan College is one of those schools in the Melee games that has one incredibly strong player and, and then a big gap between him and the rest. So uh, okay, Cap so. Captain Smuckers, their captain, is a very strong player. Power ranked in New York, um, would you know easily easily the strongest player in this crew battle. Right. But uh, Stony Brook, their entire team is very solid. Oh, okay. So e everyone's on par with equal, just about. That's scary. Yeah. I mean, basically, uh, at the Stony Brook tournament last night, um, you had. Bubba King, Minty, Vortex, um, Venti. Equal didn't enter. He, I don't think he was there. Um, but all of their players all have the ability to beat each other. They do well in crew battles. This is a very strong team. Their loss last year was to, or last semester was to Columbia, which is not not a bad loss to lose to the no. team that won the whole thing. Not at all. So now uh, Dirty Deeds is coming in from Manhattan College. Only needs to take one stock, but. Uh, Taking stocks off of equal so far has shown to be somewhat difficult. Bumps his head. All right, so we're in it. Dirty looking for grabs early. Maybe a little looking for too many. Fishing and not catching. Yeah, last week Future told me the only thing that a Marth needs to do to beat Falcon is just down throw tech chase. <laughs> But uh, it looks like he's trying to set up for combos. He wants that quick oh, kill, but he gets comboed himself. Sets, sets himself up for a combo. Goodness. Oh, and here come the chain grabs. This might be a zero to death. Oh, wow. He took Marth's jump, but then didn't didn't see fit to do anything about it. But he's got him up on the platform. Uh, and oh, my him. God. Equal is going so ham right now. There goes two stocks. 
Yeah, equals feeling really good. This is quite impressive. Oh, good try with the counter. That might have been a uh, just a, a, a misclick on his part, but... Yep. Oh, that's going to be the another stock, and oh my goodness. Equal looking to uh, extend his stock taking to 12. And he might just get it. I mean, Dirty doesn't really seem to, to have a solid plan as to how to get in. I feel like ev uh, all, all three players uh, from Manhattan College so far have gone up against Equal and not really sure of what they were planning to do from the start and it's just let Equal get his footing oh, wow. and then Equal that's it. it. 12 stocks gone. Which is really interesting because their captain, Captain Smuckers, is such a great Captain Falcon player so you'd think they'd have the matchup experience. But uh, Evidently not. Didn't seem to work out for us. So now uh, so we have Contrast Eric all right. From Manhattan College coming up. All right, number four. And he will also be playing North. Yes. That's, and that's the tough thing about having uh, one player on your team who's much stronger than the others is you, you have to try to save them because if they come out too early, they'll just get counterpicked and beat. Right. Like when uh, in the uh, USA versus the World battle, when uh, Armada came out early. And then Hungrybox went in, and our motto was character locked to Peach. Not too much he could do about it. Yeah. And uh, so Smuckers doesn't want to go in too early. Yeah. Because uh, he does have a good a good assortment of characters from which to choose. But uh, once he does pick one, he's stuck with it. Right. So he's really hoping, really hoping Contrast can take at least this stock. For Stony Brook to send someone else out. Okay, and Contrast uh, starting off. Oh, oh my gosh. Well, I was going to say, Contrast was starting off decently with uh, by not over committing to those aerials, but he just got comboed. Yeah, and uh, Mark using his double jump at any point. Bad in this matchup. <laughs> it, it's going to get you killed. And yeah. oh my god, equal. Calm and, and down. Just a DI. You got a DI away from those. You can't. If you, get, if you get hit by one, you can't afford to get hit by another. That's how they link together. Okay. Oh, right. and in contrast, finally does it. All right, there it is. Equal, so equal taking, taking 14, 14 stocks. stocks. 14. That's that's definitely the most I've ever seen one person take in a crew battle in person. That's incredible. It's amazing. Like, props to contra uh, to a Equal. That was amazing. But also props to Contrast for finally putting that beast to rest. That was getting a little ridiculous. So now we got Venti going in. All right, Venti. Very strong Fox and Falco. Oh, no, wait. Okay, so they're not putting Venti in yet. They're, it looks like they're, they're putting in Royal, Royal Flush, who had an amazing run uh, last night at the Stony Brook Tournament. Beat a lot of the top players there. He's a Luigi. Awesome. Luigi brings the hype. I we love, love I love Luigi mains. <laughs> and Luigi is such a great character to have on a crew because so many people don't so many people lack the matchup knowledge. And I feel like Luigi does have a lot of very good matchups. Um, I mean, I, I, I've seen uh, like uh, that one really good Luigi from uh, the MDV area. The name's escaping me. Kaiju. Kaiju, yeah. I see the way he oh, plays. Oh, from MDVA. I'm sorry. Oh. I thought you were talking about the... Uh, the uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're talking about Vist. Yeah. That's his name. I thought you were talking about in the Melee games. No, 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 no. I Ka meant... Kaiju and Crow, the Anderson twins, they are, they're amazing from UMass Boston. But yes, Vist. Yeah. He's great. Yeah. Very knowledgeable player. I, I played three sets with him. All of them were really good learning experiences. Awesome. Okay, so Marathon Dreamland against Luigi. This. All right, here we go. I'd call this a serious disadvantage for Marth if he were worse against Luigi, but Marth is honestly pretty good against Luigi. Right, and he's, he seems to have a pretty pretty good safe approach, somewhat understanding how Luigi's hitboxes are working, not getting caught by that down B. That's a common thing that really catches me. Oh, wow. great tipper. That might be an early stock. Oh, uh, no. Royal Flush gets back just fine. 
Yeah, it's always important to remember if if Luigi has his charge down B, which he does now. And so that's another thing to take into consideration when you're edge guarding him. Uh, usually it's it's good to go out and hit Luigi while he's finishing a side B because there's some lag on that. Right. And you can catch him there. If you just let him side B freely, then it just gets him closer to the stage. Oh, and there's another Beautiful great tipper, tipper from Contrast. All right, Contrast bringing it back for Manhattan College. Oh, wow. No DI on that forward throw. Oh, wow. Oh, a misfire. a misfire, but that's not oh, going to wow. be it. Waits too long afterwards. Okay, so Contrast really bringing this back. Yeah, contrast doing a really good job of uh, keeping his own space. You always get the spike when you don't want it. Oh, great there down air. All right, one more stop, Ryan. One more stop. Oh, wow. Very good patience uh, by contrast, and oh, he went for the uh, the floaty edge guard, but didn't w quite work. Oh, very tense moment, and well, flush gets a down smash. Of course, we are on Dreamland. So none of these are killing yet. But that might do it right there. Yep, that's going to be is. it. Okay. <laughs> All right, Man so Manhattan College down to their last man. And Captain Smucker's coming up, taking 14 stocks. Definitely not out of the question for Alex, especially considering the fact that uh, Manhattan College's remaining or uh, Stony Brook's remaining characters are all very susceptible to Falcon shenanigans. Who do they have left? So they have um, Venti, who's a space animal player. Okay. Um, they have Vortex, who plays as Sheik. And they have uh, Bubba King, who ma mo mainly plays um, Samus and Peach. Okay. Although he has a very good Sheik as well. Okay. I'm not sure who he would go in the matchup, but I'm sure Alex is comfortable with all of these characters. Oh, um, yes. So we'll see. Very, very excited to see him try to pull this, bring this back. Yeah, I'm it'll be very difficult. Oh yeah, uh, Captain Smuckers has quite the mountain to climb, but Vortex very hype. He's the sole source of hype in this room right now. And Space snares, such an important tool for. Oh my gosh! Wow, Captain Smuckers so smart <laughs> with those aerials. Oh, Alex. Oh, my goodness. Oh, and he's trying to style now. Very Captain Smuckers to go for that moonwalk all the oh time. Oh, my gosh. Great knee. Looking for a misfire. Not going to happen. Does have his charge. Oh, my gosh. That was close. But the ramen noodles. And when you do play against, uh, like, a, a clearly powerhouse player, for a crew, it's important to to understand when you have a lead like this, you don't have to work any magic. You just got to take a stock or two. Absolutely, that's all they're if he, if, hoping for if, right now. If if, if uh, Royal Fuss can take this stock, he's he's done a like great job with it. But Smuckers but has him off stage. Oh my gosh! Good patience. Waiting in his shield there. Okay, good forward tilt. Take his lunch, buddy. Oh, and oh, that's, that's be a, a stock. stock. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now, if he if he can get one more stock, then that'll just about do it. But. Smuckers is looking for, oh uh, yeah. That should be it. Should be an easy edge guard. He can interrupt this side B. Oh, see that, that down B is so important to know when they have that at their disposal. Okay, okay and that up there takes that care one. of it. But he did his job. There are three more people. If each one of them can take one stock, then that's the match. All right. So it looks like now they're probably going to send in Vortex the Sheik. He um, regularly teams with Equal, 
Oh, okay. So they play together all the time. He has a lot of Captain Falcon experience. Yeah, then uh, this should be a very interesting I've never match. actually seen him play the Falcon matchup, though. And okay. Of course, uh, Captain Smuckers is a really strong player. And so, and I'm sure, as most Falcons do, he has a slightly different play style. Yeah. So it'll be interesting to see how Vortex deals with this. Mm. Captain Smuckers. What a guy. Oh, yeah. Uh, the first time I, uh, I, I I almost had to play him in tournament once. I ended up not. But uh, hmm. when I when I, uh, I told Ryobeat about it, and he said, like, yeah, he's going to beat you, but you're not going to be mad because he's going to style on you so hard. <laughs> yeah, he has a lot of fun, that's for sure. Okay. Smuckers begins the journey of a thousand miles as he must take 12 stocks before he loses three. <laughs> Certainly not a, a beyond the realm of possibility, but highly unlikely, of course. Let's see what Captain Smuckers can do, and he starts out strong with that high pressure on the edge. for a roll there. Good jab reset. And tech chases. We have tech chases. Oh, gets caught in the jab. Oh my oh. gosh! With the ups. Oh my goodness! That was almost a stock. <laughs> oh my gosh! That'll be a stock. And that'll be a stock. Very excellent. All right, he's taking a lot of damage though, and again, he can't really afford to lose a stock to any of these guys. He really can't. Definitely can't afford to lose more than one. And that does have his jump, do it. but doesn't quite make it back. So that's the stock that he's allowed to lose to this character. And now he has to take three without losing one. Oh, wow. Well, that'll certainly help him out. Unfortunately, Vortex smiling, though. He's feeling good. His team's pumping him up. That's the most important thing after you SD like that. You can't afford to let it get you down. Absolutely not. And Especially against the Captain Falcon. Once they, once they get a read on you, uh, you're in trouble. But for the most part, Vortex staying in control, keeping the pressure on Smuckers. Oh, my That's a good get-up attack, though. Oh, wow. That oh, my gosh. Oh, oh my goodness. Captain Smuckers keeps it going. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, Alex. Captain Smuckers. Ooh, tough position here though. Oh, Gets the, the reverse nair. Uh, or, I'm sorry, reverse fair. Ah, oh, jab cycle. Oh wow, Vortex going in hard. Oh, great spot dodge into down smash. And oh my gosh. And Vortex is Vortex. to end it right here. But he doesn't. No. Tournament winner. Oh my goodness. Wow. And that'll do it. That'll do it. Crew battle Stony over. Brook wins it. Nine stocks ahead. That's impressive. All right, congrats. MVP of the crew battle being, of course, equal, equal taking, 14. taking 14 stocks. Right here. All right, so now my team is going to play Stony Brook, so we'll be out of the way. All right, good luck.